All right. Hello, 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 everyone. Um, it is time for some more Kingdom Come Deliverance. So tonight we will be continuing on with the current main quest on the scent. Um, so let us begin. I believe it's late at night. Yeah. All right. So we have some mines to explore. What time is it? It's just beginning night. That sucks. Okay. Um. I get something to eat. No. Can I cook? I. I. Yeah, let's cook some hair. So I ended up, uh, what you call it, feeding the dog a little bit and got him leveled up. So now my hound master skill is at um, 15, I believe. So hopefully I'll be able to, uh, what do you call it? I'll be able to get a good chunk of stuff, or what do you call it? I'll be able to get a good, or he'll be able to help. Wow, I'm really scattered brain tonight. I'm sorry, everyone. I'll be able to uh, do better in combat because I can sick him on enemies now. Hopefully that's something. Big old river. Yep, it's a big old river. Of course it is. Okay, let's let's grab a torch. So I can actually see where I'm yeah. going. So yeah, I'm wait, what? Oh, right. We'll go over to C, I suppose. Yeah, we'll go to C, and then we'll go to... We'll probably fast travel back to here, sleep, heal up, and then go to D, and then hopefully I won't have to go to B. Yeah. B seems like it's the most annoying one to go to. But yeah, hopefully we'll be finding little Rick, uh, Ricky. I, I, I think that's his name. I forgot how to pronounce his name. I don't know. I don't really need to know how to pronounce his name. All I need to know is where he is and how to stab him, so. Okay, there we go. Hopefully it's over here. I'm going to guess what they're going to do is it's going to be the last one you go to. Like some games do, where it doesn't matter, or it could be random, or it could just be a set one. Who knows? I don't know. The world may never know. I'll probably, I'll probably never figure it out. So, yeah. Do -do -do. Hey, oop. You'll slaughter me, huh? Yep, that's going well for you guys, huh? Oh, that's not what I want to do. I didn't want to get off the horse. That's pretty good, actually. A broad axe. Where's the last guy? Beer, 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 Ridley, beer, beer, beer. Oh, it's on potion. All right. There's the other guy. There was a third guy, too. Imagine dick armor. <laughs> Dev, there is dick armor. It's called a, uh... What do you call it? It's a... It's a nut cup, dude. A cup, yeah, exactly.
I don't think this is the mine shaft. Nope, this is not where he is. How are you tonight, Dev? Are you doing well tonight? Okay, right, we'll just fast travel back to here. So I don't have to deal with riding back. You're okay? That's good, man. Still practicing for Halo? Hello, Stingray. Okay, so we're going to D now. Right? Yeah, D. How's it going in the Discord, Stingray? Is everything still going well? You're still playing uh, yeah. Splitgate? Or, di or no, you're playing Overwatch with Johnson, aren't you? Hello, Johnson. Speaking of the devil, and she appears. No, not anymore. Oh. Do you guys get sick of Overwatch or what? What the fuck? Oh, this ain't my problem. Are those gnomes? Hey, they might be. Oh, they're trying to swing at me, motherfuckers. Really? is going on here? Camera. Are you getting jumped by little men? I don't think I'm getting jumped by little men, but... That's one down. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Really? Fucking... Oh, it's a cumin, that's why. Uh... No, uh, I'm not a gnome. I'm not a... I'm got a... Yum. Wait, no, just digesting your food right now. Are you getting jumped by little men? No, they're tall men. They're tall men. When I then play some FN, I know what a shame. What's FN? I don't really know if I need to keep grabbing stuff to sell. Fortnite? Oh god, no. I'm never. Uh uh. I will never play Fortnite. I will never ever play Fortnite. Like that is that mm, that that's mm, nope mm, not happening. A cumin cap, that's nice. You know, you know, yeah. Do one of the guys I killed right here. A common saber, okay. I guess I'll grab the saber, I guess. Oh, can I? Oh, I can I can use a glaive. Wait. Did my Why did my torch just go out? Oh, that's why. You can't actually... Oh, okay. So if you want to use a glaive, you have to temporarily pick it up and not permanently keep it. That's stupid. I wanted to be able to use a glaive. Ah. Oh. A 
and you can only swing like that, really. You can't stab. Oops, sorry. That's uh That's disappointment. You stabbed <laughs> Yes, I you can stab your dog apparently. Yeah, I guess. Hello, devil. Uh, he still should be fairly high on a- No, he's four on obedience. Never mind. You're calling ASPCA? What the- What is the ASPCA? I- I- I remember the PETA jokes, but not the- That's- That's a new one. Who would obey you? Uh... Dogs are very loyal. Even when they shouldn't be. They are very loyal. Animal Species Protection Center of America? Ah. Never heard of them. Oh, chain strike. That's not right, but I just... That's not right, but I just made it sound like it was. Fair enough, I would have believed it. Yeah, let's do... Let's get this one. That sounds like against all odds. Yeah, most of the time I'm outnumbered, so... <laughs> Being able to... Horse, make the horse, the list. A lot of arrows. Horse, horse, and horse. You beat the dog more than 14 year old beats. You beat that dog more than a 14 year old beats his meat with four screens of Pornhub premium. <laughs> That's not true. I don't hit the dog that often. Does this actually do anything? No, because it's... I guess not, no. Oh, that's probably what's taking up so much carry capacity right there. Uh, let's see. I should be, I should be fine on food. Okay. Uh, it adds to your charisma because you need all the help you can get. <laughs> Uh, it didn't look like it was helping my charisma at all, but yeah, that's true. You really do need all the help you can get with your charisma. Charisma 14. That that only gives you, what, a plus two? Aha, d and I'm so funny. My boy. You have a pl <laughs> That's great, Dev. That's great that you have a plus three penis. That's great. I'm sure I'm sure everyone is happy that you have that. We're not playing fatal. Wait, where Where's the torch if I cr wait? What? I have so many questions. Yes, I am the most stealthy of people. Oh, I found him, I guess. Are you sneaking while hoarding, holding a torch? Yes, I am. Do. Not that I can expect any use from advice. It's a bold you. strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays <laughs> off for us. You have no more cares. Need someone to talk to? Fuck! Surprise, no, motherfucker. I, I can explain. Hey, this guy is going through it. I won't tell <laughs> yeah. anyone. I swear, I've no one to tell anyway. Just please don't kill me. I'm not planning to kill you. You're not one of Runtsman. No. 
I don't know what was going on in your head, so I realized never done anything that was done at the time. It's all good. Um, I'm at the I'm here at behest of Sir Radzig. I come here in the name of Sir Radzig Kabila and Sir Hanish of Lighter. I'm investigating the raid on the Neuhof Stud Farm. I've got no idea what you're on about. I'll save you. Uh huh. If you want any chance to escape the gallows, you better come clean. All right? Jesus Christ! This will never be over. So. Fine then. That Neuhoff raid of yours didn't turn out quite well. I was trying to get the jump on someone, I would also tell them I definitely wasn't there to kill them. Yeah, exactly. You were up to it to grab some loot and bugger off. Only Rudd's cutthroats was there to shed blood. What do you mean, Rudd's cutthroats? There were two gangs then mine and Rudd's. We was only there to steal, but they wanted to slaughter everyone. But when you realized what they had in mind, you didn't have to go along with it, did you? But we didn't know nothing, even though we were going to Neuhoff. They told us to keep watch on the courtyard while they were cutting the horses' throats. Jesus, that fucking vexed me. Their horses was the most valuable thing there. Mm, I spoke no kidding. Either. Rudd gave me such a bollocking, I knew I'd better keep my mouth shut. And when they said we was going to kill anything that moved, then we knew there was no going back. Uh, your gang. That gang of yours, what can you tell me about them? There you go. Know what you want to know. There was four of us. I see that axe on him too. I will stab him. Sometimes we'd rob a place or hold up pilgrims. Never nothing fancy. I'm sure you did mischief enough. Who led you? Pius. He was the oldest and he'd mostly find the jobs for us. Plan them and the like. He got us into that fucking mess in Neuhoff too. What about the others? Timmy's strong as an ox with a brain to match. You got more sense out of a fence post. And Limpy. I was hearing aesthetic noise as well, so I'll get your dad to look. Yeah, yeah, I think it, it's an old headset trying to work brand new laptop, maybe. Uh, who put you in contact with Runt? Two gangs together. You must have made contact somehow, right? Pius. He comes to us and says he's got this prime job. We're gonna rob a farm, he says. Well, that was a big deal, because mostly we just did small stuff. A hold up on the road now and then. Nothing fancy. When they told us how much we could make on it, well, we just couldn't refuse. So Pius knew them? I suppose, but I don't know where from. We even got paid up front. I should have known from the start it was too good to be true. Where are Where's the, the other two? The gang end up? You saw Limpy, right? Yes, <laughs> but he's no use to me now. Me <laughs> Quite literally, he got a little bit strung up. I don't know nothing about Pius. He vanished in the woods. And I haven't seen him since. Timmy, I reckon, went back to the mill where he worked. Which mill? The windmill a bit north of Neuhof. Pius was the name of my boo thing in one of your D&D &D campaigns? Really? Did you know any of Runt's people? Not a word. They didn't talk to us at all. None of their faces was familiar huh. either. The only thing I know is they called that huge chief of theirs Runt. And Pius warned us to watch out for him. Isn't that funny? Haha, ha, the biggest guy there is named Runt. I don't suppose you know where they got to after the raid. On the way to Neuhof, Timmy told me he was at their camp with Pius. I, so I gotta find Timmy. Gone now. Did Timmy tell you where the camp is? Somewhere in the woods. He didn't say nothing more. Thing is, Timmy's got quite an imagination. But... Pius roared at him to shut it, so I reckon there Timmy's in the whale? Uh, maybe. He, he might be in the whale. Tell me exactly how the raid went down. Um, well, we stormed in from the rear. Runt's people started slaughtering the horses. Jesus, that was bleeding horrible. Meanwhile, me and Limpy had a sniff around the stable to see if we could find anything worth pilfering. Arctic low AG1S. What did you find? Hmm. Smill, Sir Hanish's groom. I don't know why he was up and what he was doing in the stables, but we took advantage of the situation. Limpy grabs him by the throat, and I slapped him round to encourage him to tell us where the money was. Then it all fell apart like the seeds. Quicker than you'd believe, Runt comes running up and skewers the groom like a pig for roasting. My jaw dropped. I thought the stuff about killing was just tough talk. And it wasn't. No, not in the least. <laughs> what happened then? 
This guy got way over his head, it looks like. Got through and through, and I noticed this boy standing at the other end of the stables. The stupid sods pointing at us, jaw hanging down to his knees, saying, I know you. Ron turns to us and hisses. Take him down. So me and Lubor start running, because the lad took to his heels. At the same time, we could hear the noise of the skirmish in the courtyard. We caught up with the boy at the next farmhouse. Knock him to the ground, but he bashes me with some piece of iron so hard my head's ringing like a fucking church bell. Limpy grabs it off him and stands over him with his bodkin in his hand, and I start praying. In the end, Limpy just gives him a kick and says, Beat it, Ginger. And then Runt shows up at the gate. Ginger's the name of the one guy. So we scarpered. What happened after the raid? We were waiting for that fool, Timmy. Same place as we met them before, so you'd know where we were, right? Stupid fucking idea. But Pius didn't want to leave him behind. Only when Timmy finally turned up, two of Runt's men were dragging him. There was some difference of opinion. You could say that, yeah. They started on us right away that we were traitors. They knew we'd let somebody get away, and now we were going to pay for it. They started trying to surround us, and we knew what was coming. But Limpy took his bodkin and let that fucker have it in the belly. Run. One of the others. Timmy broke free from them, and we all took to our heels. Luckily, they were so buggered from the raid, they didn't follow us for long. They just shouted that they'd find us. Uh, okay, I suppose that's, that's it. That's all I need to know. So now what do I do with you? Well... Well, what? Hey, over here. Oh, fuck. People. All right. Well, at least they're not wearing heavy armor. They're too close. We'll never outrun them. Fuck. At least they get no idea. The two of us can take them by surprise. No fucking way. I'm gone. Lucky. If you run, they'll catch up with you and kill you, and me too. Together, we stand a better chance. Jesus Christ. Here's the companion you asked for. Yeah, I guess. I was your right. Yeah, I guess here's my companion. Yay. A guy who is going to flake on me as soon as he gets the chance. Yeah. Hmm. Super happy about that. Yeah, see, this is not that difficult because, yeah, they can, the three guys can go between the two of us, but. Okay. Yeah, regardless of what happens, it's not like, um, all of them can focus on just one of us, you know? Oh, there you go. He's dead. I was gonna, I was going to mercy kill him, but I guess that didn't turn out very well for him, did it? Okay. Pick lock. All right. Where is this last fucker? Oh. oh. I've got some more questions. What? Tell me about Ron. Runt. What does he look like? Do you know anything about him? I never saw him before, but he's massive and Wait. scary as hell. Even his own men are afraid of him. Did you notice what his sword looked like? Yeah, that's what exactly what I was just thinking. It's just a regular sword, I think. Why do you ask? I think I once had the doubtful honor of meeting that bastard, and he has something that doesn't belong to him. That's just what I was thinking. It was if Runt was the guy who took. Uh, the fa my father's sword. You're coming with me. Sir Radzik and Sir Hanish will want to hear what you've got to say. 
don't suppose there's any chance you might turn a blind eye. Why <laughs> no. I didn't do nothing all that bad, and I told you everything I know. You can take wow. it yourself and leave me here, and in a few weeks I'll pack up and clear off. Johnson. I think Johnson solely has her place in first place from now on. Uh, no, I'm taking you to ra uh, Ratty. How many people were screaming at Noyhoff? Half the stables are burnt down. I didn't kill no one, and I didn't start no fire neither. Uh, you you're guilty by association, you dude. You could have warned them. I'm no saint, but surely I don't deserve to hang for that. It was them others. I don't give a tinker's curse. You were there, you didn't warn anyone, and you helped those murderers. Why you did I lose reputation? You're going to Ratai with me. You're condemning me to death. You know that, don't you? Maybe, Maybe they'll be Hannes merciful. Have mercy on you. You've had the devil's own luck so far. What the fuck was that noise? It's a bing noise? What the fuck? Okay. I don't want to fast travel. I want to get rid of that marker. There we go. Okay. So I'm here now, I guess. Where the fuck here is because I can't see shit. Wow, Johnson. Yeah, you really, you. <laughs> it is is that was was that Icarus right there, falling from grace? Yes, yes, I'll get my torch out. Alright, uh, let's get to a bed. And that one seems closer. Um, where's Stingray? I don't know where Stingray. Well, we're both getting screwed over. Yeah. I, I mean, the gambling, you know, you're, you're, it's a gamble, you know. Why do I have two heavy shields? All right. Is that, what is that buff that's going on right there? Oh, disobedient dog. Okay. Uh, let's see. Sleep. I'll probably take a bath too. Make sure it's light out now. Actually, that's good enough. I'd hit 100. There we go. That's good enough. It's still early morning. So what, what is everyone doing now that, um... Now that you guys aren't playing Overwatch? Hello, giraffe. Hi, how are you tonight, dude? Yes, yes, all right. So no, I, I'm not allowed to curse now. Okay. Because someone is being mean. I am well. Hope everyone else well, as well, too. Yeah. What am I sitting at? Uh, 12, 12, 12 not bad. 12 isn't bad at all. Okay, so what is my current kind of thing? Back up here? Really? Inquire. Oh, yeah. Timmy. Okay. Uh, someone's being a what? What do you mean? Oh, some. I said someone's being mean. Because, uh, someone just. Wow, that's really far away from. Okay. Someone's being mean because they don't want me to curse for the next 10 minutes.
Yeah, I did. Yeah, exactly. You're mean. You're a mean seven. Not wanting me to be saying naughty words. I'm gonna walk right by this thing again, aren't I? You guys ever use a urinal trowel at a truck stop? Um, I've used urinal trowels at uh, fairs and stuff like that. Never at a truck stop, though. I've never been to an actual truck stop, I don't think. So, there's that. Hello, Quebec. It's like one cup. I mean, do you or an all? Have you left your home city? Yeah, devil. Remember, I went to Canada. I've left the country. Yeah. I know this might be a surprise, but yeah, I've I've. Let's see. First time I've been to one. I was a kid, and all these huge truckers were peeing side by side. Yep. Canada doesn't count, and you know it. Canada totally counts. How does that not count? You just held it in. <laughs> You're gonna have to explain to me how Canada doesn't count as a, um... ...thing. I mean, it was my, it was my very first, I've only ever left the country once and that was Labor Day week of 2008. Yeah, I left, I left it once and that was, um, 2017, no, 2017, 2018, something like that. I can't remember. I've never been out of country. You never had a passport. Yeah, I, so I, the only reason I've gone out of country is because I was, Visiting my uh, girlfriend because she to you. went to uh, did an exchange program. A complete numbskull? Aye, he works here, or he used to. I'm not Dang sure. it! He vanished a few days ago. So that's the only reason I've ever left country, and I went out of country for one week. I had to fly from where I am to uh to. Canada and that was two different flights I had to take. I had a I hope she didn't do it on Boxing Day. That's adorable. Did you guys sightsee together? Yeah. So we went to a we went to uh, Halifax so it was right on the ocean. So we went to go look at the ocean. I don't know anyone like that. Uh, I'm here in the service of Sir Hanush. Sir Hanush? Jesus Christ. So yeah, we went to go serious. see the ocean. We went out to eat right, and stuff like that. We, back, we spent right? one week together. Like we, it was our very first time ever staying together for multiple days together. So, and we spent, what was it? One week together living in a, living in a room where you can... I've never swam in the ocean. But yeah, I, I have seen the ocean. If I said I haven't seen the ocean, that's incorrect. I have seen the ocean one time when in Canada. So. But I've never swam in it, so... Here I am. So, why all the secrecy? What do you want from Tinny? Can you tell me where to find him? Promise me nothing will happen to him. Why do you care so much? He's my brother. He's not very smart, you uh, see. Let's see, what else do we do? Um, yeah, it was very, like, the room size was, you could, it was about three steps from one end to the other end of the room. But they look like cutthroats. And they said some strange things, but I didn't tell them anything. So it wasn't very big room. There was no refrigerator. There was no oven. Tell me where he is, and I'll take care of it. Like she had a hot, a hot plate. That's how she made her meals. Was a hot plate. He's hiding at the coal 
Sylvan Farm over by Mervoyed. Um. Oh, okay. Oh fuck. The college experience, yeah, that's that's kind of not okay. Yeah. Well, she lived like that for three months. Y'all basically it was at camping. This yeah. That he knew. He fucked up. I get the feeling you're looking for someone here. I'm looking for someone too. Maybe we could help each other. Uh, I doubt it. I think so. No? Why not? Um. Because I don't much like the look of you, you or your cronies, and I don't like you breathing on me. I don't like the way you stink. So fuck off. Well, well fuck. Bold words for a whippersnapper like you. I used to have thawed bread for dinner when I was in I university. That's just how it is. Yeah. Well, I never. The pig turns a willingly. I'm gonna slot. enjoy this. <laughs> you call that a combat? <laughs> Fuck, fuck, fuck. Okay, come on. That's the handsome one, don't kill him. No, no, no. He needs to die. Fuck Chad. Actually, Chad, I have no idea, but he's a fucking Chad. Fucking come on then. Fuck. Oh my god. Oh my god, fucking, I can't get my stamina back. Stays here. I felt like that once sense. when I donated blood, the fight sword fighting included. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Fucking success. Okay, bandages. Yeah. I'm genuinely surprised I actually survived that. I did think I was gonna die. Success. <laughs> I did think I was actually gonna die during that though. Like they were super aggressive. And I would have killed that final guy too, but I'd rather. Uh, your armor resisted so much damage it seems, yeah. Yeah, my my arm, well obviously my armor is what saved me, but soul, what is this called? Soul Slicer? 
Soul Slayer. Oh my god, that's such a fucking edgy name. <laughs> such an edgelord name. It really is the Soul Slicer. Fucking hell. Very cool gamer tag, yeah. I, I bet that guy fucked every night. Does it come with a scarf? <laughs> XX Soul Slicer 69. Okay, so I think I own a I think I own a room in Majord or whatever it's called. Um, but yeah, Soul Sli Soul Slicer comes with your own. It doesn't. What does everyone's first? What was everyone's first screen name? My very first screen name was Jman two two zero five six. I I have never actually really changed my uh tag, surprisingly. It was fucking every night for sure. And it was always your mom. Yep, exactly. Quebec, Quebec, it knows exactly what's going on. Is there really no inn at this village? Really? Fuck. Hmm. Uh, damn. Okay, I guess I'll have to go to Thalmberg and sleep. Uh, Marine 1, brother. Get the Marine 2. The flamer? The heavy flamer? No, brother. Get the saxophone. The heavy saxophone. Cool mystery boy was your first one. That's not bad. That's less... That's, that's not as bad as Wolf's Last Light. Honestly, numbers in... And screen names are <laughs> really Johnson. You're just gonna, you're just gonna throw that at me, huh? You're just gonna throw me down that bridge, huh? Okay. Oh, that's the wrong way. Bro, I couldn't read. No, it's all good, man. Like I said, I I made my tag at twelve or something like that, and I never changed it since then. Like I genuinely don't know what I would change it to at this point. Like. What what would even be something I would change it to? I don't know. Uh, change it to Soul Slicer. <laughs> Mine was your name, Onion. Ah. I mean, it, it could have been worse, Johnson. Uh, I mean, you could, it, it, that just reminds me of Onion Knight from Final Fantasy. Maybe that's what I should do as another series. I should do the Final Fantasy series, do for, like Final Fantasy 1 through... Do all the Final Fantasies outside of the MMOs. That might be interesting because I've never, I've never completed the first sec or second Final Fantasy. I've never, see which one. I've never played the fourth or fifth Final Fantasy, or sixth. So, I haven't played three Final Fantasies, and I wouldn't play twelve or fourteen on stream because they would take way too long. Plus, I already have an account on 14, so I can't restart. Well, I suppose I could make a new character, but that's way too many streams yeah. because holy shit, that game, like it's an MMO. It's, it's going to take a long time. Uh, let's see, back to Majord. Yeah.
I don't know. It's raining, it's pouring. It's night out, so it's fucking dark out. Yep. I wish you could hotkey items. So I wouldn't have to constantly go into my inventory to equip a torch. I could just press three. Yeah. But unfortunately, I don't think that's a thing in this game. Yeah. But yeah, that empathy perk that you can get for having high enough speech or charisma or whatever it is. So I think it's speech is super helpful. I genuinely think that is probably one of the better perks in this game. Come on. Yeah, there you go. Because being able to know what the people's scores are is so helpful. It's, it's, it's just ridiculously helpful. Alright, Timmy. It's Timmy. Come here, Timmy. Hello, Timmy. Uh, you're also a villager, and you're another random villager. Hey, Timmy. How are you today? I'm alright. Uh, have we met? We have now. <laughs> you want to know your weirdest username? Was it Wolf's Last Light? What do you want? It wasn't me. I didn't... I mean... Shit. About the massacre. What, you did at what are you talking about? You weren't there. I, I mean... I wasn't there. Don't waste your breath. You were there with Limpy Lubosh and Riki. I heard all about it. What do you want from me? Way worse. What is it, Quebec? A whole camp full of those whore sons. And I want to find it. I need to find it. Yeah, but... But why should I trust you, though? I'm not stupid. You might be one of them. Pretending to not be one of them. Trying to catch me out. I won't tell you nothing. Uh, wow. I... Yeah, you definitely don't want to try bullying him. Do I look like someone who goes around hunting down halfwits for pleasure? No, I reckon not. But I don't know where their camp is. That's a load of horse shit. Hinek told me you were there and that Pius warned you to keep your mouth shut. You must know something. Well, once I was there with them, yeah. Only I was pretty drunk, so I'm not too sure. <laughs> God damn it. Try to remember. It was in... Rainbow D... In J dash kind of woods, you know, with uh, trees and stuff. There were some wrecked houses there and all. In the woods, a, a church. There was a church there, kind of a broken one though. Oh great! Thanks a lot. Now it's all clear to me. Do you remember which way you went? It was straight north from Talmberg. When you go uphill. From the castle, there's a path there round some well back. Land, I think it leads to the woodcutters camp. If you go so you went from cool mystery path, boy to rainbow DJ house. dash. Can't miss it. Looks like a house, only abandoned. Go to the left there and carry on till you come to this clearing with a big beech tree. Or was it an oak? Uh, you go left there again, there's this narrow path, and you go straight along there. Sometimes it splits up. You just keep to the left until you come to a crossroads by this big flat rock. You keep straight on there. I hope I don't actually need to pay attention to this because I haven't been paying attention to these directions. Right there, easy as you please. Better than nothing, I suppose. But you won't tell nobody about Neuhoff, right? You promise? Oh no, bugger. I meant to make you promise, but I forgot. 
Don't worry. But in future, Bullshit. find some other way to make money. Like honest work? Thanks. I'll, I'll try. On account of my sister, at least. That girl at the windmill? North of Thalmberg or something. Right. Yeah, I remember that. Good North of Thalmberg's uh, rundown Good church. Talk, Some flat rock you keep see? left at crossroads. You're as thick as a fence post and always getting dragged into some mischief. Did she? Yeah. She's probably right. Yep, he's going to be running around for a while. <laughs> oh, shit. I should have been paying attention, I guess. Content! Yay! Yeah! Uh, fuck. Come on. Behind some barns up a hill. Yeah. Oh, so he's fairly nearby. All right. Come on. Get through. Really? This game, this game in its bushes, man. Yeah. Like, you know, you kind of assume a horse can go through some bushes fairly easily. I don't know. I've never ridden a horse, but you know, I would think maybe I'm wrong on that. I'd love to ride a horse. I would not. I am. Uh, -uh. I'm aware enough that I will fuck up somehow and get fucking kicked by a horse. And I don't feel like getting kicked by a horse. That feels like, it sounds like that's a pretty bad time. I'm surprised he's sleeping on the ground outside of a tent. God bless you. What troubles you? Uh. Ara, ara. The bandit's encampment. About that encampment, sir. What is it, lad? Uh, I know where it is. I found out about the camp from another of the bandits. Uh, Jamie, you must face your fears. You must get kicked by a horse to overcome this fear. No, 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 no. Wanting to avoid being kicked by a horse is called common sense. To the west of Townberg. Good work, lad. Have you been to check it out? Do you know how many of them there are? <laughs> I don't know much apart from where it is. We really need to find out more. Could you go back there and try to discover anything that could help us in the assault? The more we know, the better. And if you could carry out some sabotage while you're in there, it would be invaluable. But don't take any unnecessary risks. I don't want to lose you. I'll try. Certainly, sir. That is... I'll do what I can. Don't wear ha hair heavy armor for this bit. <laughs> You'll be our I don't have any other armor but heavy armor. Depend on what you find out. Go, and get back here as soon as you can. Meanwhile, I'll muster my men. I'll find out what I can and be right back. Farewell. Like, that's the only thing I have is heavy armor. Get naked. Am, am I stripping? Am I gonna have to strip into just nothing? Sneak with your birthday suit. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Where am I? I am here. There's no good trader. Maybe... Maybe I should run to Ratty to get some normal clothes, or... Oh, yeah. So the only trader here is the one guy. Yeah, I suppose I'm just gonna have to strip... Like, is this game actually better if you play a stealth character? Instead of playing a heavy armor character? I don't know. I feel like this game might... I feel like this game could be easier or could be a lot harder if you, um... Do a stealth character. It, it would be either or. I don't honestly do wouldn't know. So, what armor would I have to take off? I would have to t probably... 
77 noise, 40 noise, that's not bad, 44 noise, 40 noise, 0 noise, 100 noise. Hope to god you don't encounter poison ivy, yeah, no kidding. Thirty-one noise. Is that pretty good? Fifty-six. Forty. F yeah, there you go. And see, four days till your birthday. Okay, four days until I get one year close to becoming a boomer. Yeah. Fun times. Zero noise, I dare ya. I... <laughs> four noise and 44 inconspicuous... Uh, inconspicuousity. I wonder if I can get even lower than that. Hold on. No. Never mind, Poison Ivy wasn't invented at this point. I don't think Poison Ivy was invented, Quebec. <laughs> you don't know, man. Fair enough, maybe. I hate Greg's port Ivy invention. What an asshole. Yeah, exactly. What an asshole, dude. I could try finding some more clothes. But I think this would, I think 44 is pretty good. We'll see. Especially since I'm going to wait until night. You get a bonus for sneaking at night? Probably. I would think so. Oh, it's raining. Raining is actually really good for me because I have the... I have a perk. That, um... Is this guy an enemy? Oh, he doesn't give a shit. Wait, what is it? What is the? Oh, shit. Go to the fork with the ruined cabin. But uh, yeah, I got a perk that, uh, or not. Is it only during night with rain? Yeah, I'm supposed to, I'm supposed to get the Rain Man perk. So, oop. I passed the fork. Uh, go with the fork with the ruined cabin. Um... Uh, I'm looking here, and it looks like the fork is right here. Right, I'm marking this place just in case, in case I go the wrong way. Because it doesn't make sense. What do you mean the ruined cabin? I'm going to guess it's talking about that. Badum, badum Tish? Where does that sound effect even come from? It, I'm pretty sure it was something with a uh, drum set for comedy. I'm 
Am I going the right way? I genuinely don't know. I'm going to guess it's this path. I'm go I'm going to try this path. You know, they have always have these marks and stuff like that for all this shit, but this is the one time they don't. Like, come on, consistency, please. Oh, take the left one. Go straight ahead, the fork by it. Okay, straight ahead. Take a left and continue on. Oh, that was too far, wasn't it? No, continue straight ahead and then take a left. Oh, it's going to be up further. Okay. This, this is this is working everyone this is this is working don't worry this is gonna this is gonna be just fine I'm sure of it I'm sure everything will be just fine <laughs> fucking Eeyore I don't know why but Eeyore just popped in my head when saying that Take a left and continue on the path to the next fork. I wonder how the author came up with the name. Well, is that supposed to be over here? No, because it said go straight from here because this is where the big birch is, right? And it goes it said straight from there and then turn Is it right over there? Is this it? I don't think this is it. I don't think this is it. No, this isn't it. Cuz it would have it would have given me objective done. This is just some woodcutters. Yeah, woodcutters camp, yep. So A 
I'm going to guess I need to go to here. I'm going to guess that's the mistake that happened. Because it said continue straight, but I did continue straight, and then it said take a left of the next fork on the road, and I did that, and it didn't help me. So I'm going to guess it's over here, and I'm supposed to take a left from here. It's the best thing I can do. Best guess I have. Just a fucking man. Dude, how, what do... There's a path on the map that runs north. Yeah, but... It said at the next fork, take a left. And I'm going to guess it was this fork right here. You can't actually see it on screen for some reason. Uh, and loose where you're going. Oh, you're going off road. Yeah, yeah, I'm going off road. Yep, I'm just going to go straight to this fork over here. Do you think there was there was a medieval traffic jams? Maybe. If you get enough horses. Yep, okay. Yeah, there you go. Take a left and carry on the junction. Take a left? Where's the path exactly? Oh, right here. I bet in the city we're with a broken wagon, maybe. Maybe, maybe. I always wondered why there were horns on saddles. Uh, we don't talk about that, Quebec. Okay, and then the next thing is... Carry on straight at the crossroads all the way to the camp. Okay. Rubbernecking is in our DNA. <laughs> yeah, yep, definitely. Although, is it just me, or has... I, I I guess it might just be me, but I've... Whenever I see, like, an, like, super attractive, like, woman on TV or something like that, I don't even think of anything. Like, it's just like, okay, oh. I don't even think anything of it, because it's like, I will never meet her, I will never have the opportunity to do anything with... You know, I'll never be, you know, it's just like, it's pointless to even think of anything. So, I don't know, that might just be me. Where does this come from? Uh, rubbernecking. Because... <laughs> you don't know that 100%. It... Well, I do, because first off, uh... Alright. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, first off, I, you know, it's like... First off, the, the, what are the chance? You know, there's no chance. There's no reason for someone like that to talk to someone like me. Second off, um, it, it just doesn't make sense. Like celebrities, not even celebrities, just you know, highly attractive females. A moat. It would take a while to get across, and there's nowhere to shelter from arrows. I don't know how to do this, but uh, I have a hot steamy sex with every celebrity I've seen through the positive mindset. Alright, nobody does that? What do you mean nobody does that? Just how did I get a girlfriend in the first place? I don't know! You're just like every you're just like everyone, buddy EJ man. Yeah, I know. I'm quite aware I'm like everyone. I wonder what Teresa's doing now. I could stop by and see her again. I enjoyed it last time. I'm very much aware that I'm just like everyone. And it's because of that fact that I go, oh, she's Highly attractive. Okay, moving on with my day. 
I don't know. I, I don't get the point of like actually putting any more thought into it than just that and moving on. I have manifest these sexual encounters with the power of my mind. Giraffe with a big brain. Never heard anyone doing more than that. Um, stuff like rubbernecking, though, that's the thing. You gotta hang out with them, then build a bond, and then you'll get used to them, thus you'll be more comfortable talking to them. Eh, that sounds like too much work. I'm going to I'm going to make a save here. That villain I'm going to fuck this up a few times. Did I just play psychologist and did you dare just disregard your knowledge? Yes, I did. Oh, I thought rubberneck was only in driving. Well, you can do it with like sunglasses and stuff like that too. Or is that called something different? I know you can do it with like sunglasses and stuff like that. You know from experience? Mm, from guys talking, yeah. Ground for a big fight. Not much cover. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Mm -mm. Stockade. A handful of men could hold it for quite a while. Really? I can't jump over this? Really? Oh, the game does not like me being right here. There are a lot of definitions of roadnecking, yeah. But yeah, I don't see the point in doing anything like that with, you know, it's like, ugh, like, what, what's the point? That, that, that's, that's what I'm trying to say, it's like... Meanie, yes, I am, I am a meanie, yes. Oh. <laughs> Oopsie. It's gonna take you till age 30 to get good at socializing? Yeah, probably. Even then, I'm not gonna get good at socializing. Like, there's no way in hell I'm ever gonna get good at socializing. That's just not who I am. I'm good at talking during streams because I don't have any face-to-face -face interaction. But you've heard me in voice chats where I've, you know, I, I don't say a lot because that's just who I am. At least you got good at Call of Duty after a day. Oh my god. It's gaming. And yes, it took me a long time to get at gaming. Fuck. Uh, 
Was? Hey. I tried to turn that around when I got sick of going to parties and seeing everyone have more fun. Yeah, I also don't say very much either, except when I get irritated by bullshit. Yep. Yeah, I've, yeah, I've caught that part of you on stream. Yeah. Fast travel point. Don't worry, guys, I can just fast travel all of us to this location, and we can just sneak in like that. No one ever expected the fast travel inquisition. Took a lot of time and effort, but eventually built the skill to be able to socialize. Yeah, I can fake it to make it, but that's about all I can do. Not your greatest moment. Eh, everyone has those moments. Really, J-Man? Really what? Ground for a big fight. Nothing. All right then. That's all you need to do, though. It's called fake it to make it. So eventually make it. Yup. One time it's because my mother got irked by my constant. Yeah, that you know, I can see that. Yeah. Okay, let's. Try being able to dish let's try to sabotage them in one way or another. That's when we played infection. Oh yeah. Yeah, you really, you really did not like Infection. We could get all the way to the camp unobserved this way. Our attack would catch them by surprise. Then we'd run straight into the middle of the Cumans. Okay. Nope, I did not. Yeah, I have my reasons for not liking it. Yeah, fair enough. I hate having to sneak around in this, this fucking darkness. I wish I wish there was a way you could snuff the torch easily, so you didn't have to just constantly go into your inventory or not and not. Like, if you right-clicked, you could snuff the torch. As I completed, it reaches camp and legendary. And those archers up there, definitely going to be a problem. That's awesome, Seven. Being able to complete legendary reach by yourself. That's dude. That's good, dude. Died a lot. That that is all. Well, it's not. It's the fact that you're able to do it in the first place. You persevered. That's the important part. 
And can you really not just climb up this? Like, that seems kind of arbitrary right there. not supposed to be up there. Uh, I was not supposed to be able to stand on that bush. Like, it seems like... It, they, it seems like they want you to, like, you know, go for the exploration and sneaking an aspect of... What the fuck, game? Wow, okay. The like, they... A handful of men could hold it for quite a while. Like, they want you to be all sneaky and stealthy like that. But at the same time, they put so many bushes and shit in the way that makes it super hard for you to figure out where you're, the fuck you're going with a torch. But if you have a torch or sneak during the day, you're going to get caught, more or less. Bushes are real bad this game by what I've been seeing from you. Yeah. Yeah, they kill the frame rate when you get close to them, too. And again, I... Hey. That's how long it took him to lose interest in me, really? Okay. Which is, yeah. Like. Heathens are a lot tidier than the bandits. It's my own recipe. <laughs> well, you won't be shooting these arrows. Okay, so was that all of the sabotage I needed to do, or it, there might be more sabotage I needed to do? I 
I'm not seeing anything else. I'm not seeing any more arrows. Yeah, this this is definitely not my specialty at this point. I am much more of a beat them in the face type of guy. Like if my stealth was higher, I'm sure this would be a lot easier, but my stealth is four out of 20, I think. Really? Shot me with an arrow. All right, that should be good enough. I did some sabotage. Fuck it. All right. I did some sabotage, that should be good enough. I'm going to just go back and... Yeah, st I'm sure that's a lot easier if you have clothing meant for stealth and also more perks meant for stealth, but... As I am now, no, that's definitely not something I want to do. Go. Is that literally... The fast travel literally went through their camp. What the fuck, game? Love fast travel, yeah, no kidding. Yeah, that's that was kind of four hundred and fifteen arrows on him. God damn it, fucking get off me. No, 
Okay, so this entire situation I'm in is bullshit because of the fast travel. This situation is bullshit that I'm in. I, this sh situation should not have happened because of fast travel. Really? You were gonna fast travel me right into the enemy's compound? Really? You draw back your fucking arrow? My theory with the current headset issue is just the case of old tech. I don't. I wouldn't know, Seven. I don't know what's with your tech. With your headset, dude. I, I won't be able to tell you. Like, this game is fun in some aspects, and then so shit like that happens, where it just makes you go, really? Really, game? You're just gonna do that to me, huh? And it, it, it makes me not want to finish it. Like... It, and this game's been out long enough where if the creators wanted to change something or something was wrong, they would have changed it by now. So this is obviously how the game is meant to be. And it just feels lacking. Devil said it was I was eating my mic, but I never had that issue till I yeah, I know. Is it's gonna it's gonna fast travel me right back through there too, isn't it? Nope, it's not. Okay. Good, because I was about to be very, very annoyed if it fast traveled me right back through the same location. We can test it, draw some kind of conclusion after stream if you're up for it. Um, maybe we'll, I'll have to see how I'm feeling. It, like every single stream I play this game, I enjoy it, but at the same time it pisses me off just a little bit more. Shut the fuck up. Kufella, that's my... There. There should be the shut the fuck up command. Yeah. Why not quit while you're ahead? Because yeah. I do want to finish this. I don't want to quit another game. The I quit No Man's Sky because it glitched out on me.
And that's that's the only reason I quit it, and I don't want to quit another game. I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. You know. Did you put the one mod on? No, I didn't. Currently, uh, currently this is completely vanilla. God bless you. I'm back from Sky. Excellent. What have you found out? Uh... There's an overgrown ruined village in the woods where they're dug in. That sounds like Pribislavitz. He used to belong to Sir Divish before Havel Medic attacked and torched it. Don't let him prison Divish. It's been left abandoned ever since. I was hoping they wouldn't be so organized. Earthworks and fortifications. That's quite a different matter from routing some rabble out of the woods. Uh, there are bandits there. It's mostly bandits in the camp. They're not villagers with pitchforks, but not regular soldiers either. <laughs> no more than I expected. I have no fear of them, but underestimating the enemy can be fatal. There are there aren't just there. bandits in the camp. There are cumans too, quite a few of them. Cumans, you say? Where the hell did they come from? Could Sigismund have left them there after he raised Scalix? This is looking more and more serious. I tried to count them. And how many of them are there? Bear in mind I'm relying on what you say. We'll have to call for reinforcements, and that's no simple matter. Every man that comes with us will be lacking somewhere else. And I don't want bandits pillaging some other town because there's no one left to mount a defense. Uh, there's... Ugh, shit. Um... There's... Seem like there's not that many. Um, hmm. I genuinely didn't get a good count on them. Uh, I suppose I'll say not many. There's a few, but not enough to give us too much trouble. Hmm, we should be able to handle that if Sir Robard sends us a few men. Uh, their arms and armor. Take a look at their arms and armor. They're not a proper army, but they're equipped quite well. What about archers? They're positioned well. Them and they're positioned well. If we charge them head on, they'll probably do us a lot of damage. I don't like the sound of that. It complicates the situation. Dealing with them before the battle would be the best option. They're making camps. They're up to something in the middle of the. Are ladders. It looked like they were making several long ladders. Ladders? That sounds like they're planning a siege. I like this less and less. On the other hand, we can use that to our advantage. If we can capture those ladders, we can use them to scale their own fortifications. That's about all I saw, sir. I didn't notice anything else. That's all right. Did you manage any sabotage while you were there, as I asked you? Uh, I managed some to destroy arrows. some of their arrow supplies, so they'll have less ammunition. Well done. That's just what we need. I managed to slip poison to a few of them. They should be too sick to fight. You're as cunning as a fox. We need more like you. That's also. Don't worry, Henry. You've proven yourself an excellent spy. <laughs> That's surprising. I need you to go to Sir Divish in Tarnberg and tell him to send Captain Robard and his men to our aid. There's not enough of us here in the camp. You can rely on me, sir. What should I tell him? Tell him to take half his men and march to Pribislavitz. We'll meet there and mount an attack. Pribislavitz. Together. All right, I'll get going. And be quick. We've no time to spare. I'll be with you. Good luck, man. Okay. Objective failed. Sabotage the bandits before the battle begins. I did kind of sabotage them a bit, though.
Oh, is that the tournament? I don't fucking want to do the tournament. Come on now. I was wondering what that A was for. But yeah, Quebec, I did not add the mod to get the better camera for combat. I kind of still want to do this vanilla style. But... It's, it's starting to get... Uh, there's just little gripes I have with this game that really ruin the experience. This could be a really, really good game. But there's just some little things that just make this game slightly less fun. Like, how thick the bushes are. Why can I not go through bushes like that? Why can't, like, come on, you can, you can easily go through a bush, especially if you're in plate armor. Bushes aren't going to stop you. Come on now. Then there's just the fact that, you know, it, there's just... There, you know... It's just so many little things that build up to bullshit. Covered the area, okay, I'm leaving. Down here? Let me see. Yep, game sucks. I wanted to say the game sucks. I... It's... Oh, oh there's Divish. God bless you. It, it's just a bunch of little things. So Radzik sent me with an important message. He asked for reinforcements. He needs more men? What's going on? The bandits and humans have set up camp in Pribislavitz. They're preparing for something. So Radzig wants to mount an assault on them, but he doesn't have enough men. Hang on. Easy now. From the beginning. What happened? That's pretty much the attitude it comes when you play games, yeah. But it's not just a gang of brigands. More like a small army in a fortified encampment. I don't know what they're up to, but I'm sure they're getting ready for something. And Sir Radzig wants to destroy them before they get a chance. So it's worse than I thought. I feel like this stream is a lot but really sir, lackluster because of my headache. You should do something about them before it's too late. I'll send my soldiers. Sir Radzik said to take at least half of your men. We're to go to Privislavitz with them and mount an assault together. All right then. Sir Radzik knows what he's doing. I'll muster the men and send them with Captain Robard in command. Would you leave my men there right now? Yeah, yes, sure. May God be with you in battle. I'll take a marigold. Dear, gain my health back. Radzik. I'm glad to see you, Captain Robard. I hope Henry's explained everything to you. He did, but I find it hard to believe. Who could possibly put together such a significant military force and right under our noses? We'll just have I wonder how much longer this game is. I don't think we will until after a battle. If we don't deal with them now, who knows what they'll be capable of in a week or two. I agree entirely, my lord. What's the plan? Right, lad. We're almost at the place you described, and I will have to advance cautiously. I need you to tell me how it looks around the camp, so I can decide which side to lead the attack from. Sir, that's a big responsibility. I don't think I should... Hey, Bessies, how are I we all? I have a bit of a headache, but how... You've but otherwise... Seen everything, so speak up. There are three ways to get in. Directly along the straight path to the camp, the long way round through the woods and over an old weir, or by a narrow bridge over a deep ditch. Let's start with the direct route. That sounds like the easiest approach. How does it look there? That path leads round their battlements. Oh, you charm. Control. The chances are they shower us with arrows on the way. It's a good thing you're here, Henry. We'll have to try another way then. What about the approach through the woods and the weir? I don't like the idea of marching such a long way over rough ground, but if it's the better option... It's a long way through the woods, and there are patrols there as well. They'll call the alarm before we reach the camp. I thought so. What about the last approach, over the bridge? It's a bit narrow for my liking. It's narrow, all right, but once we get over, we can quickly occupy the best ground for a battle. We only have to take down a few archers. The battleground sounds inviting, but that bridge and the archers, it's not an easy decision. Each option has its pros and cons. I try to answer to the best of my ability, sir. And you'll be suitably rewarded for your efforts. From what you say, the route over the bridge is the best option. 
If we're fast, we'll have the advantage. With the help of God, we'll win this day. Yeah. So I'm curious on how many more qu main quests there is. We'll approach from the south and storm the mountain. I'm gonna check actually how many more quests there is left in this game. Uh. Who knows? I might actually be getting near the game, end of the game. Uh, let's see. I'm on baptism by fire, right? I'm halfway-ish. Yeah, it seems like I'm about halfway through. So, and then there's the DLC and stuff. So, oh, let me take the marigold. 30 health. Halfway, yeah. Well, halfway, and that's not including um, other things like uh, the fact that I have uh, the DLC to do too. shoot arrows at them. Yes. Holy cap. Uh, Quebec can answer you. Yes. Oh, yeah. Kill them. Oh, you are. Yeah. oh shit, I had an ally again. Not sure which ones are our allies here. Oh, well, there you go. Bop. Hmm? Alright, there you go. That's what that was. That was a cutscene for that, I guess. That was weird. Yeah, I feel like I'm a bit low energy today because of my headache. Because of how long I slept. Because I was up really late last night. Yeah. 
These guys are getting fucking wrecked. I almost thought that was a woman for a second. Alright, alright, motherfucker, you wanna go? Low. The right. Frame right, please. I might not. I don't know why the frame rate is just being shit. Recall like at random. Oh fuck! I missed his head. That's didn't kill him. There we go. No, he's still alive. Wow. I'm impressed. This guy, this motherfucker right here, he is he is just fucking out. He's just a little engine that code, isn't he? There we go. Fucking mace me, really? Fuck you. Trying to mace me. I'll take that. Oop, there he goes. Ow, what? Oh, shit. game really does not like this. This guy just won't die. Look at that. Look how much health he's got left. Dumbass. Uh, let's see, broken. Oh, never mind. Drive them back. 
Oh, is that Runt? Am I about to get, am I about to get my father's sword back? Yeah, that's that's our Sarazig's sword. I will cleave you into you bastard. You tried before, and yet here I am. Well, barely you. You don't remember me. I remember you, though. And where's my fucking sword? What the fuck are you on about? What's You on it? Fuck me. I thought we left you to the crows. Tough little fuck. Yeah. Hey, what did you do with my sword? Judging by our last encounter, I'd say you made a big mistake, my dear. Where's the <laughs> fucking sword? But then again, maybe you've had some practice. I hope so. Because last time was too easy. One on one, motherfuckers. Let's do this. Gone weak at the knees, have you? Take that! God. Yeah, he's just gonna keep on fucking master ca master striking me. Just gonna keep on master striking me. Ow. Fuck. No. God damn it. You you gonna ever swing at me? There you go. Master bait to master Don't bait to it. counter the master strike. Thank you, Deb. Yes, I needed that. for the comedic humor. Bet I didn't even fucking swing over there. Jesus Christ. God damn it. And on originality. <laughs> Yeah, you know, I'm gonna tell you something. Sometimes you don't need to be original. Sometimes you just need to have it say something. Family Guy and Simpsons, yeah. Fair enough. I mean... Go, Henry, go! Fuck yeah! Fatality. Yeah, you 
scum. Now where's my sword? What have you done with it? <laughs> Talk, you bastard! I'd say you're flogging a dead horse there. <laughs> you took him down. On your own. Well done. Nice work. You surprised me. He was a mountain of a man. So it's not you, aren't you saying it? I stole your sword, sir. The thought did cross my mind. What did he tell you? Taken him alive, the executioner might have gotten more out of him. Oh well, these things happen in the heat of battle. Anyway, we found a trunk full of coin down below. Someone was paying this gang very well. There were some of Sigismund's barbarians among them. I don't think we've seen the last of this. Whoever engineered it was highly placed. They won't give up after one defeat. This louse was just a pawn. I'm afraid you're right, sir. Well, lad, you live to fight another day, eh? <laughs> Jesus. That one guy's getting the shit kicked out of him. <laughs> That's the fear leaving you, lad. Let it go. Now, put it all behind you. A decent Christian shouldn't dwell on such horrors. I beg to differ, sir. I never want to forget this. The time has come for those whore sons to pay for what they did to us. You're right, my boy. But first, we all need some rest. We'll meet later in the upper castle in Ratte, and then decide what to do next. Come what may, you did a good job today. That went surprisingly well. Usually I'm terrible at picking options for stuff like that. I usually overestimate what we need. Oh my god. <laughs> The ratty tur fucking tourney. I will make you pay for this. It's time for the next part of our plan. Give the word. Yes, sir. Maybe a little. Um, I might have to turn the graphics down a little bit. Which is surprising since I have a 680 X uh, XT. So, I'm kind of surprised that I need to turn the graphics down on this game. Uh, I've been rewarded a room of my own in Perkston. Objective failed. Deal with the archers? I dealt with the archers, though. Where am I? Oh, in Ratty. Okay. Oh, in the little castle area? Oh, wow, okay. Questions and answers. Okay. I'm genuinely surprised it went that well. I think I'm, what I'm going to do is graphic settings, uh... that to high. There you go. Hopefully this will give me better uh, graphics or better frame rate for stuff. Good people, come up close and have a smell. Fresh bread and pour yourself a bit of fresh milk to drink. Okay, coming here. Oh, that's not what I want to do. 
Okay, so let's grab the stuff from the horse. I actually got a new combat skill, don't I? I have one for sword. Which now I'm only using long swords, so that's kind of annoying, but sure, whatever. Let's see, we'll just do Scar Maker. Because I don't have enough points to get rest of these because it's three, six, eight, and does Blunt Strike actually? Oh yeah, Blunt Strike counts as one. Or maybe not. Maybe Blunt Strike was just free and you can actually get all the weapons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I don't know. I don't remember. And then Knight in Shining Armor, Charisma Bonus, the more plate you wear. Which is pretty good. Because this is my... Oh no, I will be able to get all the weapon perks here. Okay. So 11. So plus 2 charisma, that's not bad. Or plus 3, sorry. Oh, that's right. Uh, Inventory. Uh, broad axe. Sell those. Soul Slicer. I'm selling Soul Slicer. I'm sorry for whoever wanted me to keep Soul Slicer, but I'm never going to use it, so. God Almighty, has something happened to you? Did someone steal your fancy clothes? Wow. Wow, okay. That's something you... That's definitely something you say to someone who's you know, selling you shit. Yeah, shit happened. I was just in a fucking battle. I need my shit repaired, dude. Like, fucking hell. I'd like to discuss the... Hmm. Alright, so let's go... Here? Are we agreed? Close. Uh, let's do. Aye. There we go. Another thing, making two point four. You select that. Select that. I don't want that. Select that. Select that. Select that. Repair pretty much anything that's kind of a little bit broken. Might as well. Can we do some well. Let's reduce that down to there. Uh there. Alright, so <laughs> cucumbers, lovely cucumbers, asparagus and fruit. Okay, so that repaired that shit, but I still need to go to the tailor too to get these this shit fixed up. I should have raised my yeah, my charisma's a bit higher too. Yeah, nope, you gotta you gotta go back, Swordsmith. I hope I can So how is everyone doing tonight? I hope everyone's doing well. I'm kinda just doing this headache I have is really not the most helpful thing. Let's have a word. Well I feel like I'm a bit more low energy than I'm used to. Finally. Yep, there you go. Then go to the tailor, get that shit repaired. Y'all la later, y'all. Have a good stream, J-Man. See ya, Charm. Thank you for popping in, Charm. Hello, Crispy. How are you tonight, Crispy Man? Gods. Let's talk about... Hmm. That by that much? What about well a See now I knew There we go. I think that actually did just um more or less take all the money I just got. 
Why is my body armor in red? What? Am I like too low for it? No. My min minimum strength one. Body armor minus. Why is that? Do I have a debuff or something? Birds, no. Why is that 40? Why is body armor low then? That's weird. I was depressed earlier. Lamel must uh, must have be the weather. Uh, must be the weather. I think sort of waited for you to stream. That's why I'm, you're here first. Oh, good, Dev. Uh, you're totally good now, though, bro. That's awesome, Dev. Like, well, it's not. It wasn't awesome that you were down, feeling down, but it's awesome that you're feeling better. Uh, this tournament can go get fucked. Yeah, got all my shit repaired. I should go visit the baths. Where's the bathhouse over there? Hmm, yeah, I should go visit the bathhouse just in case. Get myself cleaned up. That is what's muddied. My spurs. And the ring. And myself. I, I'm thinking my charisma should be higher than 16. It should be possibly 18. But I'm not too sure. Oh. What the f What is that? Okay, hold on. So, there's something weird with the settings here. Uh, do they turn on, like, motion blur? Yeah, no. No more, no more, more, more blah, 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 blah. no motion blur for me, please. That that's what was fucking bugging me. Ugh. So I am someone where motion blur will f bug my eyes out really badly, and it's just it is just not a good time for me. If there's motion blur in a game, especially if you can't get rid of the motion blur, I if a game has motion blur and I can't yeah. get rid of it, I might not be able to play that game. There, there's just something about motion blur that fucks with my head real bad. Yeah. And it, it just... I don't know if it's just me or if this is a common problem or not. Let me know. Good afternoon. Tough services. Uh, you always have it on? I I don't oh, care to haggle I'm for a sure. couple coins. When I have 19k, I don't care about 10. What's my charisma now? 17. Okay. Look at that, nice and shiny. I don't have any neck chains. So, Dev, you always have it on then. Okay. I don't know. I mean, I, I just find it just just really just confusing my brain. Like, why is all that shit over there blurry? You know? It looks cool. I'm not saying it's not good. I'm just saying that I'm... If, if, I, ha if I was given the choice of having it on or off, I'll always take it off if I have the choice. Like yeah, it, it can it can do cool things. It, it and the same thing with depth of field. Depth of field. Like I will turn depth of field off all the time. I I'd rather not deal with depth of field. Wait, hold on. Was it? Oh no, I already have these out max condition, don't I? I was looking at something else. These yeah condition. Yeah, one hundred. Yep, all my stuff's at 100 condition, okay. <sighs> Maybe I should put away- yeah, I'm gonna put away these arrows that are at, like, weird numbers. Uh, 82, 95, yeah. 70. Put away those, put away those. 
I think I'll keep the wounding arrows. There we go. Much better. I don't have as many arrows in my inventory now. Oh, maybe I should do the tournament now that I'm here. Uh, is this where the tournament is held? Greetings. Yeah, sure. I'll, uh, I'll, uh... I'd like to enroll... You just made it. I can still enroll you, but... Of course. What's your name? I'm Henry. I'm Scalas. I'll make a note of that. And I need to know what weapon you choose. Uh, I prefer... Oh, shit. Um... Short sword and shield. Short sword and shield. Definitely. Good. Get yourself ready. You're next in line. Alright. Win the tourney if you can. Alright, here we go, people. Tourney time. The first combatant will be Jake the Steak, a brewery hand from Ratai. And his adversary will be Henry of Skelets from the company of Sir Ratai Kabla. Welcome, our warriors. Okay. One of ones I should be able to do fairly well in. And this very first bout will afford plenty of entertainment. Our combatants will demonstrate their skills with short sword and shield. Hey, come on. Come on, motherfucker. What the fuck was that? How did I swing through him? Oh, what the fuck? Camera, 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 camera. Yeah, right there. That's, that's, that's an issue with this game. Call me a fucking cunt. Fuck you. Yeah, I know you're over there. 
Fuck you. God, he makes such a whiny sound. Oh, I booped him on the fucking head. Woo! And the second jewel was won by Henry. Having proved his combat skills in this round and emerged victorious, he shall proceed to the next round of the Ratai Tournay. Yay! Entering the arena now will be Kolga Odatar, catch bowl of the Ratai Bailiff. Who will measure his skills against Henry of Skelets from the company of Sir Ratsay Kabla? Welcome, our warriors. All right. All is prepared for the first. I thought that was a creeper for a second. Our confidence will demonstrate their skills with short sword and shield. <laughs> What the fuck? Camera. What the what? What was that? What? How did the fuck did he counter that? The, I, I genuinely don't understand how he countered that. Okay, game. Sure. How did I lose that bout? How oh, that clash? What? How? I was so far away from him. What? How? 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 No, how? How was I raising my shield in the direction he was swinging and all of them still connect? This game is bullshit sometimes. The combat is... Fuck! Yeah, this is, this is why you just Master Strike. Yep, of course you will not. Did that hurt? Oh, What's up? Shit, you This game is ridiculous with its combat sometimes. 
Like, you can make it feel cool, but there's just times where it's like, how am I not blocking this? Yep, like... Yeah, right there. Right there. Right there, I had my shield raised, but it was still damaging me through my shield. I don't understand it. The second bout will surely be no less exciting. This one Do I just not understand out. something fundamental about this combat system? Because I've gone through the tutorials. And the camera going all fucky walky like that, yeah, just... Yeah, I'm gonna download a mod that fixes the camera. It's just fundamental at this point. Yeah, see, right there. Hold on. How the hell do I counter him, do a Master Strike, and he counters my Master Strike? See, that's just complete bullshit how you... It really doesn't, it really does feel like this game doesn't, the AI in this game don't have to pay attention to the fucking rules of this combat system sometimes. Okay, sure, I did damage to him, I guess. Hello, Crispy. Alright, now it's axes? Yeah, great, my worst weapon. By whose good grace this tourney is convened, select the weapons for the third decisive duel. Prepare to watch a fierce fight with axes and shields. <laughs> What the fuck happened right there? Bring it on. No, lock on. I'm not pressing left shift at all. Wait, what? Wait, what? How the fuck did I win? What? How the fuck did I win already? Maybe axes are stupid good in this game. from the company of Sir Ratzik Kabla. And his adversary will be the victor of many previous tournaments. Don't the question it, fair enough. Peter, called Black Peter. <laughs> the combatant's luck. 
I don't hear anyone wishing anyone luck right here. All is prepared for the first duel. Our combinants will demonstrate their skills with short sword and shield. I feel like there's a substantial difference difference in quality of the equipment here. Yeah, see, right there. How the fuck did he just counter that when I countered him? What? Yeah, lock onto him, camera. You can't not lock onto him. Seriously, this game has some fundamental fu fucking flaws. Let me guess, he's just gonna- he just counters and master strikes, more or less, doesn't he? Hello, Callie. What's the matter? Lost your balls. Fuck. And how the fuck did he do so much damage to me? fuck was that? Wait, that one? Wait, what? Game yeah, in the ancient map one has the best short story in the game. Do you already have it? I have not done any of the ancient maps. The name Black Peter just reminds me of the fact that Holland has an assistant of Santa named Black Pete. Oh, long swords. Okay. Also, here's a conversation of two spell storms after a long time. Camera d unlocked again. Wait, did I just win? And ladies, good men and good wives, you have just witnessed the final jewel in today's Ratai tournay, for which we all owe gratitude to Sir Hanush of Lipa. All glory to the victor, Henry of Skelets, man at arms in the company of Sir Radzik Komenov. Ramon, where is the fuck is the egg? It should be around here somewhere. Smurter, just keep looking. The text like said it would be around here somewhere. Wait, he did it again, didn't he? <laughs> Have to respawn. Uh, where do I need to go? Do I need to go up here? Oh no, that was the My Lord. I'm afraid you were right when you said these hostilities wouldn't end at Probislovitz. That comes as no surprise. What has happened? The men reported two more attacks today. <clears throat> ah, Henry. I'm glad you're here. It seems like we'll have another task for you. Come and join us. My lord. Greetings, lad. The bandits raided a few remote hamlets, but that's the least of our worries. They also attacked Merhoyed. Oh. A much more serious matter. Men are yet. Matthias is working there. They attacked right after the battle in Pavislovitz. Bastards are probably trying to prove they're still strong. But there's a silver lining. The villagers held them off. And they even took one captive. Ooh, wow, that's surprising. Wounded, we can still interrogate him. Your graces. I hope I'm not intruding. On the contrary, Master Tobias. Unlike Bernard, Tobias. you are the bearer of good tidings. Or so I gather from the coin you carry. Tell me, how many Groshen did we find in Pribislovitz? 
My lord, I'm sorry, but my news is no better than Captain Bernard's. These coins are very good. That is to say, well made facsimile. You're back from Overwatch. Welcome back, Stingray. Fact what? I don't give a fact what you call them. I want to know what they're facking worth. That's just it, sir. They're worth nothing. Are you saying what I think you're saying, Master Tobias? Um. This here is just a pile of copper. Kura! Fuck! Plated with silver, so it's still of some. Worth. <laughs> Kurva! Fuck! Is it a lot of work to make such counterfeits, Master Tobias? I should say so, sir. Highly demanding work. Especially to make such plausible forgeries. They would need a well hidden foundry, several craftsmen, and a source of materials. But they could just be brought in from somewhere else, could they not? Well, they could, but then again, the silver mines are nearby, and these grottoes seem freshly minted, so. So we are Fuck. facing a foe who has almost limitless sources of coin. That's all we need. Doppelganger. Well, gentlemen, it's clear what we have to do interrogate that captive bandit, find you, out. Kel, you, Kel, you really do have a problem with my scarf, don't you? Otherwise, they'll soon have another encampment. They haven't already. I doubt it, sir. Merhayed wouldn't have been able to hold them off if they did. Well, lad, I said that we'd have work for you, but it never crossed my mind there would be this much. You've already proved your worth as an investigator, so I'm putting my faith in you again. Go to Merhayed and question that captive. Find out where those brigands are hiding, how many there are, and what they're planning. And while you're at it, see if you can find some clues as to where the scarf this is all right. Yeah. is coming from. I, will, I like it. Good luck. We're counting on you, all of us. Also, would it kill you to get a, pa Come a plate curtless? As as you know uh, the thing I have right now is like Alpha. 24, or 24, or like 8, dude. It's better than anything I found so far. Way better. I prefer the scarf over the dildo hat. Fair enough, fair enough. Oh, that's... Oh yeah, here. Here, Henry. Your prize. Thank you. Thank you so much. You burned it. Take care. There you go. Finally finished that fucking quest, so hopefully it'll stop popping up. Okay, so how good are these gauntlets? Eleven eleven five. And my current ones are eleven eleven four. Alright, sure. Why not? Yeah, but it'll protect more than the brigadine. Not really, dude. The brigand 24, 24, 10. What the fuck is that bird beak helmet? It is a hound skull. It's supposed to resemble the skull of a hound. What, I'm already back down to 14 charisma? Really? Be looking like Big Bird from Sesame Street. <laughs> I mean, it it gives pretty good protection, to be honest, so... I mean... Shut up, he looks awesome. <laughs> which one... Which one big bird or G, man? <laughs> really? Really, we gonna... We gonna be doing it like that? You gonna be... You gonna be doing me dirty like that? I have, like... How many... How much coin do I have? I have 19k corn, coin. Maybe I should actually look and see if I can buy some new better armor or sword or something. Well, I got the saint sword, so I don't need a new sword, but maybe I can buy better armor. I have 19k. God save you. Uh, trade. That's a lot of corn. Yeah, that is a lot of corn. Let's see. I wish there was a compare. So that's a uh, fifteen, fifteen, six. Compared to my uh nineteen, nineteen, eight. So no, eighteen k corn. That particular hound skull is late fourth century, where when its design was refined to glance blows off from swords and arrows. Yeah, get a bushy shield. 
supply, uh, suited for short sword weapons. Defense 150. I suppose that's better than my current shield, I think. What's my current shield? Uh, I won't say. Don't think there's going to be anything better than what I'm currently wearing. Aldrin's maybe? 15, 15, 6? Oh, what am I doing? Everything's freshly repaired, so I can literally just go like this and see if there's anything better. Yeah, there's nothing better. I have the best armor I can buy right now. It's way six? Yeah. Okay, what's my current shield? It had 150 defense. What's my current shield? Uh, 133. It's not that much of a difference. 133 from 150. Arkan Basconet is the best helmet. The arching Basconet. All right. Does he actually sell that? The Grand Beskinet. 2028. My mine's better, it looks like. 22229, yeah. This man don't know how to pronounce Ark or something. I I, I don't know. I have a headache right now, that's why. Alright, I'll, I'll, you know, if you say, you say the shield is good, I'll, which one's better? I wish you could turn, spin him. Yeah, that, that's why I'm not super energetic today or anything. I wish you could see it better than just that. Now you can find some legendary stuff from your ancient maps. I could, yes. Uh, we'll we'll buy that one. Let's have a word about. Hmm. What about this? Well. Uh, and then sell this. I should have just sold it. Uh, well, they're not worth anything if you're going to use them. If you're not going to use them, yeah. I'm well aware that they're not worth anything if I'm... Oh, I can't sell the shield here. I'm well aware of that, Callie. Can we do something well? That's a since it's you close. That's a sum. Okay, fair enough. Okay. Um. Yeah, I, I'm aware of that. I'm just. I was told that the, those are kind of difficult to do, and as you can tell, I'm anything from an expert in this game. Uh, trade. Ooh, damn, that's a red and black scarf. What do you mean? What about that's better? Hi. What do you mean a red and black scarf? Mine's blue and red. Garlic, onions, mushrooms, and asparagus. Beets, just the okay, so. Or is that dark blue and dark or dark navy? My current scarf? It's checkered red and blue. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know the specific blue. Alright, so questions and answers.
Ooh, I should go see Theresa. I should actually go to the tailor and buy some clothes for her too. I'm trespassing. What? Oh, is it too... Okay. Is it nighttime now? Is the stores closed? What? No, just the tailor? Just the tailor is closed? What? I guess so. I guess just the tailor is closed. Okay, whatever. We'll go to Theresa then. Come on, game, really? Vegetables, fruits, apples, Hold on. Full screen, take off the DLC quest because I don't need to see those right now. Do I have to do that every single time I load up the game? That's a little bit annoying if I have to do that every single time I load up the game and have to remove the... I remember how your when your Henry looked like an underpaid Roman recruiter that's been tossed in shit. Wow. Putting it lightly, huh? Oh, Henry of Scalitz, the glorious victor of the Rat-Eye tourney. Um... I'll bring you something... Jewelry. Jewelry. Yeah, sure, why not? Clean your armor. Oh, wow. Is this for me? This must have cost you a fortune. But I like it very much, thank you. You really mustn't bring me any more gifts like that, or you'll spoil me. I did just clean my armor. I literally just went to get my armor cleaned and stuff like that. Don't you want to do something together again? That sounds wonderful. Everyone says the Broken Wheel Tavern is the fun place to be in the evening. I want you to take me there. Have Look at that fucking rust things? that rusty fucking helmet. I know. Me and my father used to stop at the tavern in the glade when he was taking the flower and Will you find that thing on a bandit? Wants to take me inside. What do you think, Hal? Shall we go? And just where might that be? Just above the upper gate. A little before you each retire. Oh, why not? I don't see why not. But you'll have to try some ale while you're there. I will. I promise. Let's be going then. Like, I literally just went to get my shit cleaned. And it's already dirty again. He ain't looking at you? Yeah, I guess not, yeah. Go to taverns a lot, do you? Sometimes. If I want a proper meal, I have to. Hey, lad! You wouldn't want to eat this. Don't you want a little wager on the road? That's true. I have forgotten that bet you made back in Scallops that time. Don't talk about those oat cakes. Fritz's belly heaves at the very mention, even now. And that's where <laughs> you go to woo wenches, is it? Naturally. The taverns and baths are where the best ones gather. Did you go or yeah. give Viking Hunt? Did you take it the wrong Did way? You... I'm not taking it anywhere at all. Oh, get a go for a Viking, uh, Viking Henry a little bit, yeah. I don't go picking up women in taverns. I prefer a different sort. What sort might that be? All mouth and green eyes. Yes, such a. <laughs> Come on then. It's really weird. His voice is like really off center. <laughs> so, here we are. <laughs> should we, uh, should we order something? Yes, definitely. <coughs> Service. <laughs> ah, a pair of lovebirds. <laughs> what would you like to order? Mm. Is it, uh, is it right? It's excellent. Oh, you mean Bandit Henry? This eh. There's no better in the province. Mm. You know what? <laughs> what? What are you doing? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> Uh, but, but really? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, come on, be brave. No, I've never... Hand on my hip. I, I, I don't even know how. And off we go. But, but really, <laughs> I, I, I don't know how. 
<laughs> You're doing just fine. All right. <laughs> Except they're floating. Oh, it's all right. It's fine. <laughs> 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 you wore me out. And you said you couldn't dance. I don't know why the frame rate's so weird. How about you leave me alone and bother someone else? Oh, come on. It's a crime to waste a body like that on a scrawny boy like him. You got tits like a cow in calf. That's it. I like a woman to fight before I fuck her. Yeah, I wanna go, bro? You wanna go, bro? You'll pay for that, boy. Oh yeah, you wanna go, motherfucker? Come on. Come on, let's go. God! Come on, come on, motherfucker. You wanna go? You wanna go after Theresa? Come on, come on, come on. Leave him be, you bastard. Ow. Yeah, you want to go after Theresa, motherfucker? Come on, come on. You got to be at least able to kick my ass. Ooh, okay. Come on. Should just sick the dog on him. Oh, you still want to go? You still want to go? I thought you were down. <laughs> just fucking left hook, just straight into his face. Oh, you should worry about the other fella. I'm fine. Ow! Of course you are. That's why you wince every time I touch you. <laughs> that was so good. He wasn't feeling so playful after you'd finished with him. That tickles. Faith. Her clothes are going through each other. Only a fool dances in his armor. You'll probably be fine. But try to give your hands some rest. You don't go lifting anything too heavy. Thank you. I'll take you home. You never give up. Are you sure you don't need a bit more rest? I can find it's raining. Home. I'll manage those few extra steps. Come on then, hero. Singing in the rain. I'll give you this. Nights out with you might be painful, but they're never boring. I do my best. <laughs> You should go in before Peshek starts fretting. God damn. Henry got game. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> that that was the best fucking reaction. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I think she has an armor fetish. She might. Jamin's exact reaction after his first kiss. Uh, you know. <sighs> oh. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> uh, 
Um, I mean, kind of. I mean, I still remember my first kiss, so. Still need to find work for those two. Mine was instant boner. Mine wasn't. Uh, I was more kind of confused and kind of eh about the entire... Like, I wasn't eh, but I was... It was a very confusing time for me. Hey, lad! Don't you wanna... I'm glad to see you. Uh, bet on the Rattati tournament? I've already done the Rattati tournament. Uh, do you have anything new? You got treasure map 7. Didn't I buy this off of you already? Or no, sorry, 12. Holy shit. Huh. Let's have a word about the... Well... Since... Come... Ah, uh, da da da... There we go. Mine would be, did that happen? Did I do that? <laughs> Look up Ancient Map 7. It has St. George's Sword. I already got St. George's Sword. So in reality, I don't really need 7. Did I just bite? Hold on a second. Did I not just buy 12? As long as you remain still, you're tired. Okay. Well, you need a spare. <laughs> Let's see. You don't need me? Wait, what do you mean? I, you don't need me? Wait, what do you mean? What, what do you mean? Seven. That's why I can't get that one. Um... Let's see, increases by three, but your same thing works. You just have a minus one. I mean, this is kind of good. Plus two to charisma, minus two to strength, but I kind of want my strength. You said I don't need seven. Oh, yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah. See, none of these seem super good to me, The these perks. None of them seem super good. Because I kind of, I mean, I suppose I can get my strength back up easy enough, I suppose. But at the same time, well, I should, what I should do is um, do the strength perk. We'll look closer. The number is like my women. Seven is a good number. It, the number is like my woman. Why is your woman seven years old, Crispy? Reap, yeah. Let's see, my older. FBI open up, yeah. Uh, let's see. Very rare that I actually fight in villages. So, Savage is probably the better perk. Scout is pretty good, too. Isn't Crispy 7? I have no idea. I think he's, I think Crispy's like 16. Uh, increased by 20. I'm kind of going between Savage and, and the Wilds. You have a plus 7. Yeah, why not? Oh, 
Wow, when did I get Kumin Killer? I don't remember ever getting that perk. You're not seven. You're not 16, you're younger than that? Um, alright. I don't know, I don't remember. I don't spend my time trying to figure out how old you guys are. Fourteen, that's seven times two, yeah. You're you're eleven teen. You're you're a tweenager. Is that the word? Is, is that what he's almost twelve e twelve e v eve twelve eve? Man, I'm getting tired. Let's see. Eleven. Yeah, I just had all of this shit just uh what you call it? Fixed up. You're I am not one hundred and eleven years old. Oh why well, you're not? That's a shame. Okay, so courtship I need to wait for a friend in need. Brainer1388, thank you for the follow, man. How is it going tonight, man? Uh, I'm also, at this point, 11 away from hitting 200 when doing the reading stream. So. And I call you a big brain. Let's see, I need the perk. Maybe I should go hunting a bit. Brainer, I love you. Let's see. Uh, maybe I should go hunting a little bit and try to um, get the perk so I can get... Oh, Crispy coming in hot. Yeah, no kidding. I mean, I suppose it's best to get the perk that it gives you more speech. I kind of want to... What? What is that? Is that supposed to be a light bulb? I kind of want to love you. I restarted yesterday in the game. In my opinion, it's an underrated game. Uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance. I think this is a game that has some... I think this is a great game marred by some fatal flaws. Uh, what's my hunting at? Where's the next perk at? Eight? <laughs> I should have gotten the Tanner one, where I could skin dead animals. That's one I should have picked up. Complete that quest. Uh, maybe I'll hunt off stream. I'll do the hunting off stream, so you guys don't have to sit around and see me level that up. Um, questions and answers. But yeah, I, I find... I, I like this game in a in the sense that 
this game has some very good concepts and does some things very well and then other things it just falls flat on um such things like um having you f the, the combat style is not meant for 1v car carcass on a road uh ignore it like the combat is like Mordhau or for honor where it's very much meant for 1v1 or 2v1 kind of those situations uh avoid it and they like to why are you slapping me with a horny bonk and the game likes to throw four or five guys at you sometimes and it really breaks the combat you kind of just have to give up um in other situations um it, it, the combat just it, the master strike scene it censors the word slap for you really wow in other instances the master strike and the perfect counter system seem really the both you and the ai take advantage of it way too easily it still has some annoying bugs yesterday i restarted a couple times the game because it i was blocked on my horse no moves yeah yeah like i said oh god who is that who is that beautiful black horse what sylph are you talking about my horse sylph in here But yeah, like I said, this game... Uh... Antony, my beloved Antony. Oh, oh, I'm, I'm so, uh, oh, I'm, oh. Oh, I'm, mm, I'm gonna... Oh, it's like Leigh Brown, yeah. I love horses, not in, in an intimate way. Yeah, Crespi, why are you being weird, man? Is there a bath here? Can I... I should have taken a bath before I uh left because my charisma is at 13. I would have put on it to be at 17. I think that's where it normally is. I need to talk to someone who's around here. I know I saw some bitch around here. Hello? Hello! Could you tell me, uh, villager? Good day to you. Yes, good day. What's, What's happened, happened here? here? Things are bad. Very bad. First, we get attacked by them brigands. Barely come out of that alive. Now the plague. I'm sorry, the what now? Indeed so. Something's up with the village. Even the livestock are dying. It's a gruesome sight. Uh, tell me about the fucking plague. plague. It sounds terrible. Worse than you can imagine. The whole stud, livestock, sheep, chickens, all dead or dying. No doubt the fuck, 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 fuck. Old woman's taken to her bed and it doesn't look good. Is this the Black Death? Straw's wife and brother, more and more. I'm sorry to hear it. I'd like to talk to Straw. I see. Well, if you stand at the main gate of the stables and look across the road, you'll see Straw's house on the right. Okay. Where will I find Melicha? If you stand at the main gate of the stables and look across the road, Melicha's is the house on the left. Okay. Matthias. I'm looking for Matthias. Matthias. He works as a stable hand at the stud farm. Matthias. The brigands got him. Oh no. He's lying wounded at the stud. Uh, who are Makila and Straw? And Straw. That's right, you're not from around here, are you? Melikar's the one looking after things around here now. Before that, it was down to Smil from the Neuhof stud. But they killed him that time they raided the place. And young Straw is the son of Anton, a local woodcutter. Or was, I should say. The bandits saw to that. Mm. His old man isn't taking it well. Did you put up a fight? Up a fight? We most certainly did. 
Once Melikar heard young Straw shouting to the hills, he handed everyone a pitchfork or a flail, and we ambushed a them. A flail. Off. Good on you. Oh, wow. Did it turn out? We gave them what for until they turned tail and ran. But they cut up young Straw something awful. He didn't live to see morning. Who attacked you? Who attacked you? I don't know. Some bandit. Ever since Scarlet was raised, they've been marauding the whole province. Uh, I heard, heard something about a captive. Get very far here, though. Luckily, young Straw saw them still over by the cross and woke the whole village. We even captured one. He's tied up now at Melikar's place. Okay. But then the disease came. Okay. Thanks. That'll be all for now. May the Lord watch over you. That dude was real helpful. Okay. Talk to Matthias. Is he alive? Oh, he is alive. You're a sight for sore eyes. What are you doing here? It's good to see you too, Matthias. Sir Radzig sent me here to investigate. I have no idea who this guy is. Sir Radzig? Looks like you've come up in the world, mate. You're here as his envoy? Uh, He took me into his garrison. He took me into his garrison. Hal the blacksmith's boy in the service of his lordship. Who'd have ever thought you of see the I problem? Why, this is why no one should give me anything worth money. Ow. You survived. That's something to thank God for. True enough. If I were in your shoes, I'd get the hell out of here. There's some disease spreading. Disease? Folk is saying it's the plague. Whatever it is, it's bad. It started the day after the raid. First the horses got sick, then other animals, and now people are falling no. in. No. How are you? Are you alright? Well, well, Spend it wisely, fuck. It, but you've been hurt. It happened during the raid. One of those damn bandits fell on me, horse and all. My arm's badly broken, but better than a broken neck. Fair enough. The raid. Tell me about the raid. What do you want to I have? believe I still believe. I heard you capture one. I hear one of the raiders was taken captive. Wow. Questioning. Why, old Melikar let him have it over the head with a flail, and now he's locked up in the barn. But be careful. Why is that? That fucker killed young Straw. His old man's sharpening his sickle for him. Melikar still hasn't decided what to do with him. Uh, I understand his I understand old Straw wants revenge, but first I have to question that bandit. What happens after is no skin off my nose. Good luck then. <laughs> uh, what did these raiders look like? Can you describe the raiders? I don't know. Oh my they God, crispy! So you couldn't see their faces. About twenty of them. They weren't humans, though. They spoke Czech. You talked oh. to them? No, no. They were shouting at us. They were very sure of themselves to begin with, but when we hit them in the woods, they didn't look so brave. I know you've got courage enough for any man, but how did a bunch of untrained villagers manage to hold off armed bandits? One of the village lads caught sight of them coming through the woods and told Melikar, who roused the whole village, and everyone grabbed what they could. Pitchforks, axes, flails, and we went out to face them. What? You mounted an assault against them? Aye, and that was the key. It was the last thing those whore sons expected. A few of them still managed to break through to the village, probably wanted to torture. But even the women here were armed with what they could find, and they took the bastards by surprise. Damn. About this sickness. When did the plague start? When did this plague start? The oh my god, the raid, Callie. The horses were lying down in the stable, so we knew something was up. By afternoon, they were all dead. Then other animals started getting sick, one after the other, and then people. What are the signs? That's important. What are the signs that someone's getting sick? Well, I don't leave the house much, but folk complain of fever and shakes. Some are throwing their guts up, and others are spewing from the other end. Ooh. People die from it. Aye. Old Verba. Although Vrba. he was already on his last leg, so no one Vrba. was for sure if it was the plague that got him. Either way, 
The animals are dropping like flies, and people will end up the same for sure. Uh, who's sick? Who's ill now? I don't know. What with my arm the way it is, I don't go outdoors much. But I know Melatar and Straw have sick ones at home. All right. Uh, Can I ask you a bit about Mephiyed? The infernal chaos and deceit of gambling months. strays us off the path. Way. Yeah. Um. I already know all that. Okay. Um. Pestilence. Yeah, we should probably take care of this plague problem. That sounds like it's a bit of a doozy. I suppose we can deal with the plague problem after we've interrogated the captive once we figure out where the fuck he is. Uh, to the left? Are you straw? Oh, there you go. Are you Melikar? Oh, aye, that's me. I need to speak with the prisoner. And why is that? Dirty ass hound skull. Yes, yes. Envoy of Saradze Kobala. I'm here to investigate the attack. I'm sorry. I have other things on my mind right now. In case you hadn't noticed, we have pestilence raging here. And Saradzig won't help us with that. Still. Any more than he helped us when we were attacked. Ah, uh, yeah, he doesn't know Their anything. Has reached Rattai of any disease here. But I'm here now, and I can help you. Hmm. Yeah, there's no command like Steel. Well, since you serve Saradzig, you might be of some use. If anyone can be. Tell me what to do. There's a stable hand living with us here, Matthias. Yes, I know him. And he knows some girl who helps out in the monastery infirmary. Your hanker, I think her name is. She might know someone to turn to, if she's actually there. Okay. Very well. I'll go to the monastery. It's probably our best hope. Thank you. At least for taking the trouble. But then... Even if you cared nothing for us, the prisoners got the pestilence too. Oh, great. Die without help. If I have to go to the monastery, I need to know as much as possible about the disease. I'll definitely need to know its symptoms. They're bound to ask me that. Fever it's and... Yeah, My fever and chills. Feverish. Others have the chills. I heard some are throwing up. Others still are breaking out in sores. But why don't you see for yourself? People talk a lot and I don't know what to believe anymore. Very well. I'll make the rounds. I've daubed lime on the afflicted houses, but don't stay too long in those homes. <laughs> that I can promise you. Good luck to you. Okay, so houses with crosses on them, like Anthony's, have the plague. Which I've already entered one because I'm a dumbass. You should do slow chat so you could read out all of our messages. Uh, the chat's not moving fast enough for me to worry about that. Greetings. Uh, what, what happened here? Horrors, master. We were attacked. Master, ooh. Jesus. That's right. Okay. Uh, tell me about the plague. I don't want to tempt fate by talking. There's not much to tell anyway. It hit us just after that rab. Okay. Okay. So she's got nothing. Yeah. Well, shit. Yeah. So slow chat is meant to for bigger streamers than me. Like streamers who have um, so so many people talking that they don't, you know, they can't Sorry. read without it going too so can't fast. You see, we have the plague cross on the door. I'm here to help. My name is Henry. I'm going to the monastery to get help. It's long past time. The Lord's already taken my poor Anthony. And what do you want from me? I need to know how the illness afflicted your husband. Yes, I'll tell you everything. But first, help me bury my husband. I'm too weak. Uh, Henry with the, the cross sign, yeah. Should be buried at once. <sighs> yeah, sure. You. Thank you. We have to bury him at the back of the house. There's a lovely linden tree there. I understand. I'll dig the grave there. Thank you. When you're ready, come back. I'll say goodbye for now.
You're big, kind of, like 180 followers. You're the tenth. You're a tenth of as many followers as this robot guy. What do you mean I'm a tenth of the followers of this robot guy? I... I... I still don't feel like I'm that big. I don't know, maybe, maybe my perspective is just really skewed on what big is. Because I'm comparing it to like Olive, where she has 2,000, you know. It's done. Thank you. Now please take him there. Oh Lord. Is she just following me or is she gonna walk her own way? Is it over here? Is that how you get over there? Alright. I jumped a fence. Oh, then you're really small. Yeah. Yeah, see, I'm comparing it to like Olive, but I, and also like uh, the guy I raided last night, Ghost, uh, Grey, Grey Wish, there you go. Grey Wish has like 500. And so it's like, I'm... Well, as your people, th thanks, thanks, Callie. Will you please tell me about his illness? Certainly. My husband had the fever all over. Anything else? He had great pains in his belly. He okay. said he felt like he'd been stuffed with rocks. He was writhing all night through. He fever, stomach pain, terrible. stomach cramps. Thank you. Okay. What did you get from digging that grave? Uh, information about the sickness. I'm trying to get accurate information about the sickness. That's common between all the people. So, fever seems like a very common one. Stomach pain is seems like a common one. And you did a terrible job. It's, it's, what do you expect, dude? This is a plague house. Oh, go, go away. Bobbing and shells are two more details. Yep. But I'm trying to confirm if those wow. are confirmed or not. You're not allowed inside. If you want to go in, talk to Melikar. This is another plague house. What? Have you come for my wife? You're out of luck. I'm old Straw, don't you know? Straw! You've taken my son. But you shan't take my wife. You bastard. Wait, what? Uh, I've come to help your wife. I've come to help your wife. Out for over to the other side. Isn't that God's own truth? I don't have time to God explain damn it. everything to you. I need to. So you don't have the time. Come here, you fucker. God damn it. No curva. Crispy, thank you for the 30 bits, man. Your first time donating 30 bits without being being timed out or sound alerts. Enjoy, J man. Thank you, Crispy. Thank you very much. Ah, yeah. Oh, you fucking kicked.
Maybe you can't fight the shithead, yeah. Okay, okay. That's fine. This is fine. You're talking about Henry? Yeah, I know you're talking about Henry. I'm talking about Henry too. He's got metal fucking gauntlets on and he can't KO this son of a bitch. You're a cunt, motherfucker. Fuck you. Yeah, no shit I missed. Okay. <laughs> I'm kind of sad this isn't the real world where that shit would have been knocked over. God damn it. Lockpick very easy. Open. Hey man, you've been sh has been streaming. Yes, I've been streaming for quite a bit. Hmm. Fever. Just like Melchard's wife. Okay, fever. Hmm. Fever. Just like Melchard's wife. Okay, you you That's ready to talk? Tonight. Fuck you. So fever. Okay, so fever is definitely confirmed. He hit his back on the shelf. Shelf wins. Yeah. K.O. <laughs> So, okay. I've gone. That's Ant. That was the Anthony one. Ditch straw now. Is there any? Oh, here's another house. Daniel. Brother, dearie brother, is that you? <laughs> one one thirteen. Yes. Yes, it's me, your um, brother. I don't is nearly here. We need to get the skeleton. Oh god, I had to experience that once. I rose up and hit the back against the edge of ward shelf. Up. Oh, yeah, that's that's Wait, great. You're, you're not my brother. You're one of those brutes, brother. Lock the door. Oh, they're back again. Please, God, no. Brother, don't you recognize me? It's me. I'm. Your brother. I was gone for a long time. I come back home for Advent, remember? Yes. Uh, yeah. I remember. Give me a drink of water, brother. Oh, I'm thirsty. Terribly thirsty. thirsty. I feel like I'm burning in hell. I can drink a pitcher of water and right away I'm parched again. Good luck to you. Poor man, yeah. Oh, I'm trespassing? What? Okay. So, thirst is another one. So, fever, thirst, stomach cramps. Uh, what else is there? Possibly vomiting, possibly diarrhea, chills. We haven't encountered any chills, though. We haven't seen anyone with chills. We've only seen fever. I don't know if there's anyone else around here. Okay, so... I think I've gotten all the information I can get about the disease. Nope. Here's another door. Vincent, Jesus, all right. Jesus, lad, what are you doing here? Can't you see the play cross on the door? I'm here because of it. The monastery sent me to help. God bless you, boy. It's about time. I need to know exactly what you're suffering from. Oh, I see. Well... Fever again. I have a dreadful fever. My wife, too. I recall almost nothing of yesterday. I was raving for most of it. Is there anything else? 
apart from the fever? Well, forgive me for saying so. The shit just pours out of me. I can't oh, wow. get anything in. I'm completely worn out. My wife's the same. You have my thanks. I'll try to bring help. Wait a minute, will you? I have one favor to ask. Um. Well, tell me. I need to write my will. Can you write? I can. I might manage that. Excellent. So get writing. Yes. I, Vincent, son of Vincent, grandson of Vincent of Mehoyed, <laughs> do bequeath my estate and all my worldly goods to my wife, Wilma. If my wife were to pass away with me, mm -hmm. what? I bequeath all to my cousin, Dobesh. Uh -huh. At this time, the cobbler in Yanovitz. In no event shall my prodigal son, Elia, the layabout and good-for-nothing, inherit a single groschen. All customs and traditions aside. Um, should I write that too? Yes. And then write, the executor of my last will is to be my good friend, Father Fabian, presently the parish priest at the Church of St. Martin in Sassel. Anything else? This will was written down by. What is your name? Henry, presently in field teacher Sir Radzig Kobola. Well, I never. That will add some weight. Here, take my ring so Fabian will know it to be truly from me. You can never be sure nowadays. Oh. Uh, where can I find where him? Where can I find Father Fabian? Well, where do you think? All right. St. Martin's Church, of course. What are your son Your do? son, Elijah. What did he do to you? Christ Almighty. Trying to interfere, are you? What did he do? Everything. And then a whole eight generations of Vincents were born, yeah. the house and ran off. The little fucker. Last we heard, he was some jackhand in Sasso. Boozing, playing dice, lying and cheating for a living. Such a disgrace. All right, I'll be going. All right, I'll head off then. Yes. Go now. Go before you catch the disease. Then where will we be? Last will and testament. Okay. So the church way down there, pestilence, which is over here. Okay, we'll go to. Oh, it's the same town. I'm gonna hit the hay. Enjoy your rest of your stream. Thank you, crispy man. Thank you, crispy man. Time to go to Sasu. You're not saying goodbye to Seven or Quebec? Wow. Oh, good night, afternoon in Quebec. <laughs> Skirmish! That's not fuck with that. Armed men. Yeah, no, thank you. Hello, Charm. How are you? Okay, there we go. Okay, so we have... Yeah, well, we're going to take the will first. St uh, still amazing. It's been a good week. That's great, Charm. I'm glad you're having a good week. Is there any particular events that are, you know, that you want to talk about that are amazing? Or is it all hush hush? You discovered church. Well, let's not pick lock my way into a church. That sounds like a bad time. I'd rather not share as... It's pretty as it's pretty hush hush. All right. All 
Are you the father? No. Are you the father? Yes, you are. Vincent sent me. Vincent Is it cool if I post a tier list here? Um, sure. That's fine. I mean, there's a also if you want me to do it on stream, there's a command for it. I'm bringing Vincent's last will and testament. Almighty Father, he must. What happened? Master Vincent has been taken seriously. Yeah, you have to do tier list. Yeah. Disease has spread in Mehoyed. Yes, I did hear that people are sick in some village hereabouts. God yeah, heaven. there is a tier list where you where you do tier list and then the additional yes. thing for the tier list, the no. little additional part outside of the tier list dot com. I have an example on the Thank you for panels. If Vincent passes on, I'll see to his wishes. Here, take a few coins for your trouble. Thank you, Father. Farewell. One hundred and seventy-five Russian. Yeah, I'm not gonna get involved in that family's issues. Their their shit is their shit to d deal with. I ain't gonna I ain't gonna get in between that. Ooh, vitality leveled up. Yeah, you you did it wrong. <laughs> so you're not supposed to. You're only supposed to add the J Man's Halo Crew po point. But it's all good. I, 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 the main reason I do that is just for people who send, who are new. Oh, holy shit, your health will regenerate gradually. Yeah, yes please. I don't care about any of the other perks. You don't follow? It's, it's all fine. That's good. I, I'll get last gasp too eventually. But yeah, just being able to regenerate health outside of combat. Yeah, yes, please. So you're not supposed to add the tiermaker.com. Should you do it again? No, it's all good. It's all good. The main reason I do it like that is because I don't want people who are I, I can just click the link easily without having people send me like to weird sites when doing that. But I, I know you won't send me to a weird site. It's for more. It's for newer people, I should say. People who aren't a regular. And I, I've known you long enough, Seven, where I'm not worried. If I do, it's by accident, yeah. That website doesn't work, remember, Jamin? Oh, does that site not work? Is that the site that doesn't work? When you try moving the squares? Oh yeah, that isn't the one, because I have tier... Is it tier maker or tier list that doesn't work? I forgot. One of the one of those two doesn't work. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Tier maker does, tier list doesn't? Okay. Okay, so yeah, I gotta fix the command then. Thank you. Thank you, Quebec. Thank you for reminding me of that. I'll make sure to fix the command. What am I doing? I can get there way faster by doing this. And increase my horsemanship skill. I remember to go through the big one this time. Don't want to dough myself again. Oh. Wow. Huh. Thomas? Tink? 
He'll be able to get out of this on his own. Johanka? Uh, Henry? I'm glad to see you. Me too. I heard that you're doing well. Not right now. Matthias sent me. Matthias? My god, did something happen? Uh, I don't know yep. if you've heard about it, but Merhoyev was attacked. Oh my god! How is Matthias? Wounded in the arm. He's being brave about it, but his injury looks bad. I need to see him. Before you go, there's something else. What? Some kind of disease has taken hold in Merhoyev. Their livestock has died off, and now the people are coming down with it too. I thought maybe someone here might know what to do. Merciful heavens. How awful. It's a good thing you've come here. If there's any hope, this is the place to find it. You need brother Nicodemus, the monastery. Nicodemus. He may know how to deal with it. Very well. I'll try to find him. Come back when you know more. Okay. Thank you, Johanka. Is he over here? Yes. Uh, raid? What? Oh. He's, uh, one of these people. Recipe for, recipe for elite in water. Uh, oh, the alchemist dream. My alchemy is not, ooh, treasure map. Sure, I'll buy the treasure map. Uh, I suppose I'll buy the recipe for elite in water. And I'll buy the dream, why not? Let's talk about the price. Well, we... Okay. Is this enough? Come now. Uh, there we go. Aye, that was... Yay, okay. Uh, Plague Outbreak. What kind of disease has taken hold in Merhoyev? Your house said that you might be able to advise. A disease, you say? How intriguing. Uh... <laughs> yeah, yes, sure, yes, whatever. Interesting, but can you help these people? I can't say at this point. I need to find out a little more. Tell me, has the whole village come down with it? Uh, about half the houses. No, I mean, not yet. Several households have around half the village. Merhoyed? Isn't there a stud farm there? And what of the animals? Did they get infected too? Yes, there's a stud farm. All the animals died. And they've all died off. The horses, the cattle, chickens, and now it's got to the people. That is most intriguing. What are we to do about it? Do you know the symptoms? Yes. Uh, I know. Yes, more or less. Excellent. I have several extensive volumes here in the library. Describe the epidemic, including the symptoms, and we could take some guidance there. Can you read? I can read. Yes, I can. Excellent. So follow me to the scriptorium. Where do we so, start? Where should we start? Evidently there's something amiss in the digestive tract. In the what? The digestive tract, Henry. Um, right. Ah, the trouble lies between the mouth and the arsehole. Uh-huh. <laughs> sure. Just so. We can rule nothing out at this stage. You look in the Breviarium to Sickness Causa. It's a renowned manuscript from Salerno, written by one Johann of St. Paul. But I don't know Latin. Fortunately for you, our brother librarian is translating these momentous medical works into the common tongue. So you can still be of use. Study the Breviary carefully and compare the symptoms with the recorded cases. Okay. That will guide us. I'll try the proven classics. Avicenna and his Canon Medicinae, and Galen's Magnum Opus, the Ars Medicinalis. Ars. <laughs> uh, okay, so this is one hour. Okay. Blood, yellow bile, black bile, and figure if these are, ba are in balance. Okay. The excessive music may also lead to death for you, for example. The body endeavors to get rid of coughing, sometimes sensible. Plague caused by the black bile fluctuations. Oh. Okay. 
Okay, so it's not that. It's not the diphtheria. Plague caused by black bile fluctuations often exhibit many signs. These include fever and by malaise often altered with spastic coughs, perhaps even diarrhea. When the body uh, endeavors to rid itself of excess black bile of, and great thirst. After a few days, sores. I, I didn't hear anything about sores. Later, black spots are seen on it. So it might not be that one. All animals do not uh, suffer from the plague, but big ones do. So it's not the black. It's not out. The perfusion of yellow bile can lead to dysentery, which is manifested by various signs of primarily by violent, violent diarrhea. Cough, vomiting is present only rarely. The sick also suffer from terrible thirst, abdominal cramps, and fever. It is transmitted from person to person, but animals do not suffer from it. Okay, that was close. The yellow bile is close. Um, but the animals not suffering from it is the problem. Okay, but there are other ways in which the inner humors are disturbed and the blood weakened. One is by poisoning, which is manifested by fever and delirium. Stomach aches, brings convulsion, diarrhea, and great thirst. If a person is poisoned by ga by gas, for example, with in mines near swamps or similar places, or rash around the nose. There were no rashes. Is not transmitted between... Okay, so it's not that one. An interesting case of imbalance in internal fluids is the St. Viterius dance, which is manifested by the infecting infected dancing wildly, consorting and twisting. They may also sing, scream... Okay, that's not it. None of these. The closest one is the yellow uh, bile. Okay, so it's I'm I'm only allowed to read this book, I guess. It's very important you zoom to one hundred percent fifty percent before viewing. Alright. It's it's this one. It's the poison one, isn't it? Could it be? One such as by poisoning. Um. However, this rash does not occur if the poison is ingested through food through, through food consumed. Poisoning is not transmitted between humans or animals, but if they all drink from, the, for example, from the same source of water, they, then the people are infected. People are infected as well as animals. The latter often sooner. It's poisoning. I think I have it. Yes? It's poisoning from tainted water. Really? That sounds rather unlikely. But if Master Johann of St. Paul's says so, who am I to contradict him? We shall have to prepare some medicine at once. Um... I can try helping. I could help with that. Really? Yes, I know my way. Oh no, I don't. Arts. An ordinary fellow who knows the arts of physic. Who would have thought it? Excellent. I'll give you the recipe, and you have my permission to make use of the monastery laboratory. I'll get started right away. Oh shit! I meanwhile shall head straight to uh, where was it again? Merhoye. Oh yes, Merhoye. I'll take your hanker with Fuck, you. I messed up on that one. Calling caring for the sick. Once you have the medication ready, hurry after me. Thank you, Brother Nicodemus. Good luck. Good luck, Brother Nicodemus. And to you, Henry. Hank, I'll get me. me more? Certainly. Beginner. Like All right. Uh, 50. Agree? 
come next. A great good luck. Tackle. Running. Running ultimate. Shit. I'm interested in wouldn't you rob Well another time. Oh boy. <laughs> Fuck I fucked up. I should not have said I could make it. Prepare the remedy. So um I'll deal with that tomorrow. That's tomorrow. That's tomorrow J-Man's problem. Not tonight's J-Man's problem.